I love day eight on this practical journey to a new way of living. Sacred insight for you is our own trust today. You know, when we are going through a lot of change, energetic shift, emotional releasing, stepping into who we're truly meant to be, getting to know our soul, getting to shift into a new identity, trust may come up. And then we ask, divine, show me the evidence. Help me to recall the times in my life where you have told me to do something. I really didn't want to because my human nest was really afraid, but I went ahead and did it. You made it. Everything okay. If you haven't had those times, I'm sorry. Start looking for the evidence of that. And if you think you have to do things hard, hard things will start happening, right? Or have been happening. Maybe ask to learn the lessons a different way. But I digress. So I wanted to give you an example. Trust. This tells you a lot about my personality and my humanness. I would much rather, if I am if I am guided to go somewhere, I would much rather take the back road rather than the highway. Don't like going fast. I don't mind taking breaks. It scares me to get, in, get into that fast lane and go. And if I am on the highway, I'll let others go around me. I would rather do the right thing and get there safe than be so chaotic about it. But this particular time, as I'm driving to my destination, Divine says, take the highway, Sarah. Divine knows my feelings on this. So I take the highway. Did not take the back roads. I took the highway. I made it around the loop to enter the highway, the roundabout, whatever that's called. And I'm entering the highway, entering the interstate. There it is clear for hundreds of feet in front of me and hundreds of feet to the back, clear. There is no cars, no traffic, no semis, nothing, just me easily entering the highway. Now there's still traffic on the highway, hundreds of feet in front of me, hundreds of feet behind me, they're coming up. I have to kick it into high gear. I get up to speed, but I'm safe. I'm taken care of like I always am. That is an example for me of how I can trust that when divine tells me to leap, to change what I'm doing, to start these sacred insights on, on YouTube, that I trust because there has been evidence in my life. Now I had to recall it. It wasn't in the forefront of my mind. I'm still human, at least some of the time. <laughs> and I still get scared, especially when, when divine is taking me out of my comfort zone. But I entered the highway. I was safe. We made it to our destination in record time. I am always taken care of. Always. What are your beliefs? How has divine taken care of you? Recall those moments that feel like they are insignificant, like entering the highway. That it just happens to happen. That there just happened to be no, no traffic. Could you change your perspective of it and see that it was divine timing and that you were always taken care of? 
that you can trust the guidance that is coming through, those nudges, those divine whispers, however it is that, that you receive. Are you willing to trust divine and yourself to take the next right step? Cheers, love.